back is to assure you that in ADC, we have very committed members across the constituencies who will not allow any form of compromise or electoral malpractices to take place in their respective police units. Because the only reason why we are not in the Edo State of Azami today to represent the Oriol South is not because the man who is there today is more popular than we are or perhaps more acceptable. The only reason, I tell you, was the compromise and the lapses that were permitted by members of my former my, my party. I wouldn't want to lead or to expose to the public at this point in time the strategies we have outlined as a committee and as a party to ensure that there is no repeat of that scenario, very, uh, very uh, sorry scenario of a man who didn't actually win an election, you know, going to the uh, to occupy, as it were, illegitimately a public elective office as a member of a Justice Act of Assembly. I start to be contradicted that where as we have it now, this election is insulated from undue interference and compromise. ADC will be the party to beat. ADC will be able to produce and deliver on the candidacy of Friday Osakawa Ogeriaki for Oriomo South constituency and Chief Dr. Uh, Adran and as the Court for Oriomo Mode for that constituency. Because if you look at the feed, look at all of the candidates on the feed, there is none of them without standing in models that have the kind of rich pedigree that the candidates of the ADC parades. And our people, we know them and they know us. We are always with them. I let me use this word. Many of those today that are that want that are seeking <coughs> election, either to represent uh, Oriomo or Wode, and of course my own home constituency, Oriomo South. They are native foreigners. We call them native whom the party ADC have considered fit for the positions of House of Assembly and House of Representative respectively. By my right here, there's no other person than Mr. Honorable Barrister Friday Ogiraki. He is our member, a candidate, and a chairman of a campaign committee of ADC Highway Call Stroke Ogiraki, respectively. ADC, Mr. Bondi Ojo, you welcome, sir. 
Closely followed by Mr. Jackson Mafidon, the chairman of the Modern Local Government ADC to Kusat. Welcome, sir. Yeah, thank you very much. Because of time, we will invite our chairman campaign committee, head, uh, I will call through. Consider as the holy person that can restore hope to the hopeless and rescue Nigeria for these power bank politicians. Therefore, a vote for ADC is a hope for life. A vote for, a vote for Chief Dr. Adrian Iwekor Davison is a restoration of life and a rescue of Nigeria's citizens. And once again, I say thank you all, and God bless you. And I will also say that we Nigeria should put hands together to vote at bad government for our future. We should not sell our future for one Kobo. We should not sell our future for four Naira and suffer for four years. <laughs> Promising us that they will do this and that. After that, giving us one error, and later they disappoint us. We can't go to their house, they will use their score to drive us away. That's why ADC have come to rescue Nigeria, to rescue Nigeria, to rescue Mwonge, to rescue Oromo. Let us vote at bad government and bring, it, bring in a new government. Thank you all. You have been in this game for quite some time now, maybe close to eight years. And then the last election you contested and then maybe you were dissatisfied with the process. And you took the matter to court, but after everything, you could not uh, get uh, justice. What do you think you've put in place now to guarantee your success in this next uh, general election? I want to thank you for taking uh, me back uh, to memory lane. Uh, the only thing I want to let out of the bag is to assure you that in ADC, we have very committed members across the constituencies who will not allow any form of compromise or electoral malpractices to take place in their respective police units. Because the only reason why we are not in the industry of Azabi today to represent the South is not because the man who is there today is a man of his words. He's a man that has lived all his, most of his life in America. And he's, he's not an hungry man. He, he gave birth to me and he trained me up. He has been a loving father to me. To also his own family. His family is proud of him. In America, they are proud of him. If you go to America, in Eastern Texas, when you find out a bad chief Dr. Andre Davidson, they will tell you he's a man that sees something and he, he, he works with it. He's not going there to 